Welcome to M2Hockey and HockeyShare.com. In today's video we're going to talk about changing the angle on a shot. So before we actually get into the technique of changing the angle, we're going to talk about why it's important. So if I'm coming down for a shot here on, on the net, I've got my defenseman right here. In this case I'm just using an attack triangle. We've got the puck on our forehand in this case. And if I change the angle, basically at this point, from the eyes of the puck, the goaltender set up exactly where the puck is if he's a good goaltender. Now what we do is if we change the location of this puck slightly before we release, so in this case we've moved it about three, four feet, now the goaltender is no longer square on the, on the placement of the puck. So basically what we're trying to do is we're trying to get this goaltender um, to, to be squared up in one place, change the angle of it quick, and release it from a different point so that we have a better chance of scoring. The other thing this is effective for is on our defenseman, at this point I'm trying to force a shot through the legs. And obviously what happens a lot of times when we try to force those shots through is we hit shin pads, we hit ankles, and they don't get through to the net. So now the defenseman thinks he's in line with the puck, now we're again we pull it in and now we have an angle to get the shot around his body so and get it back through the net. So the actual technique for it is fairly straightforward. We're going to talk just about the forehand side. So we're going to set up like we're ready to take a forehand shot. Now, before we shoot the puck, we're going to pull it in slightly with our toe. We're going to bring the puck underneath the body. And this is especially important for older athletes because the older athletes will be able to sit into the stick and flex it a little bit and, and still get a lot of power and a very quick release off the puck, off the shot. So we pull it in here and now we've changed the angle and we can fire the puck. So coming down, set, pull, in, fire. So again, here, pull, fire. Now as we as, again, as the athletes are bigger and stronger, that can turn into a snapshot or even a quick pull and quick shot like that, quick mini slap shot there. So what we want to do again is start to practice this stationary first and we can do that one of two ways. We can actually turn the triangle to the side so that we've got to move it even further. So we have to work on the bigger pull and shot pull shot and we can also work on it moving where we're actually coming in, come in, pull and fire. So again this is just a nice little way to work on and practice the ability to change the angle on the goaltender and the defending player. Hope you find these tips helpful. We'll see you next time at M2Hockey and HockeyShare.com.